Hi, my name is Father Greg Labus. I am pastor of St. Joseph Church in Edinburgh, Texas, and welcome to Saint of the Week. Today we're going to talk a little bit about St. Paul Miki and martyr companions. In the Gospel of Matthew, we hear Jesus commissioning the apostles to go out to all the ends of the earth to bring the good news of the gospel. In the 16th century, the church realized that there were other peoples that had never heard the gospel, including many peoples in the Orient, which includes Japan. St. Francis Xavier had brought the gospel there in the early 16th century, and the preaching of St. Francis Xavier brought many converts into the church. The Japanese people were very open to hearing the gospel and following Jesus Christ. Our saint this week, St. Paul Miki, was born in 1562. He was educated by the Jesuits and continued to be part of the church growing in Japan. In 1596, a Spanish ship was discovered with artillery on board. This suspicions of other peoples who happened to be Catholic led to persecutions of the Catholics in Japan. St. Paul Miki and 26 others of his companions were forced to walk 600 miles to Nagasaki in the cold and in the ice and snow. But they were joyful at the same time. And as they got to Nagasaki, they saw, saw a hill where crosses had been prepared for their crucifixion. When they saw the crosses, they ran to embrace the cross. They were crucified on those crosses, but on the cross, they were still singing and preaching from the cross. And ultimately, Paul Miki, from the cross, like Jesus, forgave those who tortured him and killed him. St. Paul Miki and his companions can be examples for us of forgiveness. For all Christians in the course of their life come across times where someone has hurt them or done something bad to them. And for every person, it's difficult to forgive. When we hear and read about uh, people, especially saints like St. Paul Miki and his companions, who had the joy of the gospel in their heart and they were able to forgive their persecutors, so too can we forgive. Jesus has given us the example of forgiveness. We pray that in the Our Father every time we pray that wonderful prayer of Jesus. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Let us follow the example of St. Paul Miki and all the martyr companions of his. Through their example of forgiveness, let us ask their intercession to help us forgive one another. Thank you for joining us on this week's episode. May God bless you, and this has been Saint of the Week.